Right, in today's vlog, my friends, it's sunny. Oh, gorgeous weather. And do you know what we need? We don't need any fish and chips. We no. don't need any full English breakfast. We, we need something nice and healthy, like a jacket potato. Is that what we're going to have today? We are, yeah. So we're here at Carbank Park in Mansfield, and we're going to go to the tea rooms there for a jacket spud. Hey, hey. hang on a minute. Who's this? Look who it is. <laughs> Fancy seeing you here. It's Paige. <laughs> I tell you what, when my wallet's out, she's never that she's never that far away. I can tell you, it's a, what, what fancy seeing you. It's like it's like we've just bumped into each know, other, it's isn't it? It's not like we set this up or anything. I know. No. Now you've already eaten today because with yeah. the last vlog that we filmed, you had a massive breakfast. Yeah, I did. I'm but still I only from that. basically I only had and, and you ate the rest of the cheesecake. Basically, <laughs> I only had. Well, I think it was one or two sausages and I didn't finish the bread, even though it was gluten free. So I'm going to have a jacket potato because it's lunchtime now. You've, you can have a drink though if you want. Yeah, I'm not eating anything. You're not eating I finished off that cheesecake <laughs> when I dropped. You finished <laughs> off the off. cheesecake. And, I finished and they off went the without cheesecake. me today because I had to work this morning. Anyway, I'll tell you what, normally I'll do the intro. So you can do the let's go bit. You do the if you're new to the channel. So do you want to do yeah. that? If you're new to the channel, like Get a bit and closer. subscribe. Get a bit closer. If you're new to the channel, like and subscribe and click that little bell, please. Go on then. Let's go. No, you've done that wrong. What? You said let's go. Do yeah, no, it's not. You, don't, you, you can, do you know what? That's why. <laughs> that's why I do this, right? I'm, it's, it's, I'm drunk on cheesecake here. So it's like. <laughs> English breakfast. Anyway, without further ado, my friends. Do well, it like with, I with, thought you was doing that bit and I was going let's go. Oh, well, yeah, but you've got, to do, it, you've got to do it with enthusiasm. <laughs> All right. right. We've got yeah. to be enthusiastic. <laughs> so. If you, what, you've got me doing now, so now without further ado, do, my friends, let's, let's go. These two here, come on in, come on in. All they've done is whinge about the weather, right? Oh, it's too hot, we're it's too hot. You were, you were saying it's too hot, it's too hot, it's too hot. <laughs> but what we did get to the bottom of, and we agreed with is, right? Mr. Whippy and ice cream vans, right? You can always hear them when it's raining and it's winter. Ding, 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 ding. And then when the sun's out, where is Mr. Whippy? Where's Mr. Whippy? And there isn't any. Do you remember though? Now then, I don't know whether you remember this one. My mum, if you've not seen this one, have a look. I'll put it at the end as well. There's a link up there where Over I delivered. I delivered an ice cream I to my mum with a drone yeah. on a drone in covid times wasn't it yeah. it was yeah and i delivered it over Bless the over it. the house and delivered it so go and have a look at that one it's really good but i want to miss the whippy there's no way there used to be one in mansfield if you live in mansfield there used to be one called divots in mansfield town center in the market square when mansfield was a proper marketplace does that one not do it on the corner of the market the is it american sweet shop or something do they do maybe we should it? have a i don't know whether we've got time i don't know whether you'll have time to have a walk down if yeah. we hurry up and have this jacket spud might have a look and we might have a look and see whether we can get an ice cream so i love a mr, a whippy. mr. whippy and apparently right now then listen to this you're probably a little bit too young for this one however you tell me whether this is true in the comment section down below I'm getting out of breath now. <laughs> <laughs> um, Margaret Thatcher apparently invented Mr. Whippy, the soft ice cream. Really? Is there any truth in that fact? Or, well, is it a fact? Is there any truth in it? Let me know in the comments section down below. But apparently Margaret Thatcher invented the... Wow. the uh, yeah. You wouldn't have thought it would have been called a 99, though, would you? You'd think no. it would called a number 10 or something. Maybe. Anyway, come on. Onwards. <laughs> oh, it's too hot. Come too on, hot. stop moaning. <laughs> Right, 
So, what have you ordered then? Uh, two jacket potatoes. Two jacket spuds. One with cheese and coleslaw and one with cheese and beans. Oh, you've had cheese and, cheese beans. and beans. Now then, are they? Are the Heinz beans? That's the big question. Well, we're not quite sure, are we? But they're quite nice beans here, yeah. aren't they? And it comes to eleven pounds and ninety pence for two jagged potatoes. We've had water, haven't we? Yeah, iced, water. iced water. Paige is not eating because she's uh, pigged out on cheesecake and <laughs> she's full had English breakfast today. this morning for breakfast. I've, I basically had a sausage and a, a little bit of bread. Uh, but jacket potato, healthy. However, yeah. you're probably going to say not cheese and coleslaw cold. isn't, and then you've got. But it's not healthy. Not is yet. it fiction then? Is it? it it's healthier than chips. Healthier than, yeah, definitely healthier than chips. You can, yeah. make, a you, you can make a healthy jacket you potato. It, I mean, you've got to have butter though on a jacket. Lurpak as well. It's got to be Lurpak. You like pages behind <laughs> the camera. You've got to have Lurpak. And you don't want none of that. Yeah. Now then, can you tell a difference? I'm going to ask you in a minute. Can you tell? Have you, do you like Lurpak? Yes. Can you tell a difference between Lurpak and Norpak, which is the uh, rip off with the Aldi version? Can you tell a difference? Yeah. You can, I can, yeah. Now, Paige is a massive Lurpak fan, I'm gonna ask her the same question. Can you tell the difference as well? Pop it in the comment section down below. Can you tell a difference, Paige? Yeah, I can. It has to be Lurpak all the way. I don't, if you're gonna pay for, like, butter, you might as well just go pay for the Lurpak. Do you not have Norpak then? No. No. It's just a cheap version of Lurpak, isn't it? <laughs> That's what it is. Snob. She's a snob, yeah, a I butter only, snob. I only have low pack when I come to when I go to mum's though, because uh, it costs about six pound now, is it? It's rip off. Yeah. Yeah. So I have the cheap, I have the cheap stuff at mine. And I go to mum's for the real good stuff. Shall I tell you what to do though, Paige? Right. Next time you go to your mum's, you take your Norpak, take the base of it, take the packaging <laughs> off, and then you take the Lurpak back and just swap, put, swap the packaging on. Or just swap the lid because she probably won't notice anyway. There you go, do that, there you go. I mean, I'm not saying that's the right thing to do, but it is. <laughs> Right, okay, so you've got your cheese and beans, yep. Heinz, makes all the difference, doesn't it? it does. Beans means Heinz, <laughs> uh, and I've got cheese and coleslaw, but it's like homemade coleslaw as well, which is good. A bit of healthy salad on the side yeah. there. Uh, and um, anyway, I'm not going to film every angle of it because it's, it's a jacket potato, but very nice. Um, skin's all right there as well, yep. skin's pretty good. Um, yeah, pretty good. We'll, we'll have a round of pasta. I'm going to let you eat it because otherwise it'll uh, go cold. Anyway, take a closer look and then um, we'll come back to uh, you in a minute. So there you go. I've got some salad cream here as well. Got to have it. They were talking. Share? share my salad cream. Well, we know what you're like for not sharing it. Come share on. my salad cream. You just have a little. Are you having a laugh? Yeah. You should have asked for it. Does my head in? You heard me ask for salad cream. Why don't you ask I for some? I thought you might have bought us, you know, a few packets. It's not packets. It's proper salad well, cream. All right, I'll go with that then. But now you're making me feel guilty. Well, let me have a little bit then. Go on then. Hang on then. Oh, just. Is that no, enough? That's, that's okay, yeah. Is that I enough? That <laughs> thing. I like to. Where's my ketchup? Because I've got ketchup. Because I like to. Ketchup. There you go. You can have, you can have a little bit more. Because I'm going to mix a little bit of ketchup with it. Anyway, we'll see you guys in a minute. I'm put, I'm got to mix it up a little bit like a Bernie. A bit more. Yeah, but mix it in because I can make my own um, Bernie Steakhouse so sauce. Then can't I mix it in together? It's mayo you're supposed to use with that. No, you, you you can. You're supposed to, but it's much better with salad cream. There you go. Mix it in like that, look. Oh my till it, goodness. Till it goes pink and then you've got your nice Bernie Steakhouse. Right, I'll see you guys in a minute. <laughs> Need more butter on my potato. You're being healthy. Do you know 
what? Right, I'll start with, with, I like it in there, so I'm going to be very careful how I put this, right? Because yeah. I love it in there, it's a wonderful place. It's a great little tea room, uh, and it's one of our local it haunts, is. really, and I like to support, support local. It's, and you just said, I don't really know what to say about this. It, it wasn't the best jacket potato that I've had. The amount of time that we waited for it, I think, because they were very busy, yeah. I think the jacket could have been a lot crispier. It was, it was virgin. I, I don't think they did it on in the microwave, but it was virgin on that microwave kind of skin that you yeah, get. Yeah, it wasn't as crispy. It wasn't We've as crispy. It really, in well, lockdown, really nice one in yeah, lockdown, yeah, we had a good one when we sat outside. If you go back through some of the videos, and it was a lot bigger, and it was really nice. So maybe it's just an off day today. Yeah. But um, not the best that we've had. Not the best, not the best, but there you go. We'll have a quick wander around and see whether we can get an ice cream. If I was, if I was going to mark it out of 10, I'd probably go 7.4. Yeah, I'd go around about there. Yeah, 7.4, which is a shame because I love it. So if you are watching, by the way, don't hate us when we come back <laughs> in again, because uh, we will come back in again. It's just, you've got to be honest, wasn't the best, very busy. I have to say, though, did spot the afternoon tea yeah. there. So we wow. are going to come and book with you to have the afternoon tea yeah. to show people. And we'll do a review on that. Amazing. That was a bit nice. Yeah. So, and it is a tea room, so there you go. But they were very, very busy. Uh, so there we go. We'll have a wander on. Where's yep. Paige gone now? She's she's gone having a little she's, wander. Oh, she's she's in the she's, baby she keeps she, she keeps going in the shade. <laughs> but come with us anyway, and we'll have a little wander. We'll have a little mooch around <laughs> Mansfield. It's a wonderful day. So don't go anywhere. Come on, onwards. Do you know what? Oh, come here, you two. All these two. Paige, how old are you? 29. 29 year old, right? I'm out of breath. <laughs> 29 year old. And all she's just going is, oh, my legs, <laughs> my legs. <laughs> and Angie's gone, it's right too hot, it's too hot well. to warm. They do ice creams in there. <laughs> I don't want to walk in this heat. It's, it's a lovely day. It's nice. It's nice. We're just enjoying our time together. Come on, then. Let's go. Yeah, let, no, it's onwards. We know it's onwards. But why do you say let's go then? Why did she say let's go? It's like, can you say onwards, my friends? Onwards, my friends. Not very enthusiastic, that was it. Come on, <laughs> onwards, my friends. <laughs> just, just, just come here a minute. Stay with us, right? Because I've just said to Paige, I went, now you see up there, right, in that top window up there, that top left window, and she went, oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me it's where you met your first girlfriend. No, actually, it's where my grandma, your great-grandma, my dad's mum, used to live in that top uh, corner flat there. So oh, there you sure. go. Yeah, I'm trying see, to tell you. you learn see, something every I was trying day. to tell you a little That's bit of fun. That, yeah. Well, there you go then. So don't start snapping my head off. <laughs> What's a great granddad? Yeah, it's normally what you say or come out with, isn't it? Though? It yeah. is. No, it's where Grandma Davy used to live in that top flat so, there. Granddad's mum. Yes. There you go. See, see, she, children. Well, you're not really a child, are you? But you know what I mean. Anyway, come on, onwards. If you hang on a minute, I'll tell you another little bit of information as well, right? Yeah. I'm a mine of information, but my dad, your granddad, his best mate was called Jack Tyler, right? It was Jack and Alice Tyler. And this place here, right, just here, this building here, if you wait a minute, right, was a shop. And they used to live in the flat above and they had like two cats. And I used to uh, go and play up there. Well, I used to go and stroke the cats and stuff. But my dad's best mate lived there. And, right, I, I, I think I've said this before. Because um, it was a shop, Alice, right, who was my dad's best mate's wife, used to have this powdered orange juice called Rise and Shine that she used to bring <laughs> up to the Lake District at the weekend and come up to the Lake District with his rise and shine, you had water with it and it was like, I don't know why you'd have powdered orange juice, but I used to love it, it was great. Anyway, mine of information, is that one a bit more boring? Yeah, yeah, yeah a little bit. Oh, come on then. Now let me tell you a story. When Dad was in America when I was a kid, he used to monitor, monitor me on this camera and he told me if I wasn't in by nine, then I'd be grounded for a month, was it? Yeah, a month. So you'd see me running. You'd see me running <laughs> down the drive. Hang on a minute, <laughs> hang on a minute. I didn't really want this story telling. I was working, sorry, I was trying Stop to just the you to there. I, I was working, I was working in America when I lived there for 12 years. 
and basically I needed to keep an eye just to make sure that I was still in there, you know, on your, in your life and stuff, mm. you know. And I made sure that you was in for nine o'clock. That was if all. If it was one minute past nine, yeah. then I'd be grounded. Yeah, well, the, the time was on the cameras. Yeah, no, but I'd be grounded. I'd be out of breath. I'd be panting because I'd just legged it home. And then I'd be one minute late and after yeah, I but, I, I, well, I just but hang in a minute. Let, let's just let me just let me just stop you right there, okay? Your timing has always been the same. So, oh, and yours is yours is better, is it? Well, hang on a minute, right? So today, what time are you going to be with me? I quarter to baby. quarter to ten. She was going to be with <laughs> me today, right? And I got a text at quarter to ten, leaving now, <laughs> and it literally was nine forty-five. And I said, "You're supposed to be here for nine forty-five, not." leave at 9.45. Yeah, but I had an important phone call though, didn't I? And then I had a uh, birdie to feed. There's always an excuse. It should never be because you see that important phone call you could have took at, at the office when you picked me up. So anyway. She was busy, so I couldn't. On, right, anyway, on that bomb. <laughs> you, listen, there's no excuse for being late. Come on, onwards. Mansfield District Council, just a little pointer, okay? So now we've got to push the baby into the road because there's a whacking great tree uh, coming out the sidewalk here. Sorry, sorry, not Americanism, just, not, pavement here, and right? Not just one time, but right. three. But three, three of them, right? Just, just cut the trees down, level the pavement off, and then you don't have to have babies' pushchairs going in the road. That's my, hang on a minute. Oh, my minute. other pet peeve people parking on the pavement, fully on the pavement. It's illegal if it's more than three quarters. It's, there you go, it's illegal if it's more than three yeah. quarters. There you go. But yeah, anyway, it, the council will be like this, right? They'll be like, no, council rules, can't do that. Can't do that, then he'll get his apple out and his corned <laughs> beef sandwich, that I've said before. Anyway, come on, onwards. Electric cars, you can't hear them. They've just nearly got run over by an electric car. Hey, I've got an electric car. Rubbish. What do you think, what do you think of electric cars? Absolute rubbish. They are rubbish. I think it's just all. They just come out with some rubbish. Where's it? Like all olden day stuff. I mean, I'm only 29, right? But 29 year old. It's future. It's your future. Yeah, electric cars. I don't think so. I think some things are good, but now I think they've just. It's all money making nowadays. Sound like Grandma. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like my mum. It's all money making. It's all money. That's all it is. <laughs> <laughs> Just, just stop one minute, let's get over here because there's a car coming in. It's in a bloody electric car and you can't hear it. Right, so within, I have to apologise ladies, all right? Okay, right, get your milk float over there and park it up. Right, I have to apologise because within two, two, two minutes of coming into, uh, is it a hybrid? Oh, it's a hybrid. Um, within two minutes of coming into Mansfield Town Centre, a guy on the left went and gobbed on the, on the pavement, right? And then a guy outside the pub back there, within Wait, about 10 seconds, he did it on the pavement. What is wrong with people? No, Come what is on. wrong with Mansfield? Yeah. Jeez, it's, it's had it, it's done. I had a nice done. morning until it came down here. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Just look at this thriving market. What have we got here? Oh, we've got a couple of phone stores there. Some market, um, About four market stores. Yeah, uh, McDonald's. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you don't see them anywhere else, do you, McDonald's? No, you don't. no. no definitely not. <laughs> Wait, we found one. We found a Mr. Whippy. We found a Mr. <laughs> Whippy. Come on, ninety-nine with raspberry juice on it. Ninety-nine. What are you having? What are you having? Well, I don't know, I've had that cheesecake. Plus have an it, ice cream, come on. I don't want an ice cream, Dad. <laughs> Go on, have an ice cream. I don't want an ice cream. I, and there won't be 99 pence, by the way. They'll be no. about £2. Are you ready? Let's wait for how much it's going to be. Yeah, and then he's going to stop me. Hang on a minute, do you know what? This is this. You can't be my daughter that, that was the same daughter when you was younger because he'd be like I want an ice cream I want an ice cream now you're like I don't yeah, want an ice Caitlin cream oh that was Caitlin actually yeah there we when go said oh I'm excited a 99 here we go Ooh, look at this Mr Whippy right what well, do you hold it to me then you can't get the staff here can you it's supposed to be cameraman 
I'll have to, um, now it's cash only, controversial, uh, so, uh, but you've got to keep cash in this, because don't go card only, otherwise that's it, total control, should be choice though, anyway, I'm going to get to Mr Whippy, got a cone, a I don't want a cream egg cone, we'll have a Mr, we'll have a Mr Whippy, 99, are you having a flake? Yes please, yes, you're having a flake, and I want raspberry sauce on mine please, can I have a Mr, can I have a 99 with raspberry sauce please? Uh, do you want small, medium, or large? Medium, and please. Medium. So two, two, two of the same, please. Two of the same. There we go. Right. Look at that. I've got some cash, isn't it? Oh, there we go. Right. Oh, get, oh, I'm looking forward to this, Mister. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at these. Oh, hang on a minute. Oh, yeah. How much are they? Two fifty. Two fifty. That's a fiver. Oh, we'll go for that. Um, Oh, can I have a bottle of water as well, please? Yeah, we'll go for that. There we go. Do you know what? Paid just for a bottle of water. I thought I could just use this fiver, but now I've got to break into my tenner now, haven't I? There we go. <laughs> Six pounds once again, please. Thank you. Brilliant. Thank you. Look at that! We do need to keep cash. We do need to keep cash. Otherwise, we'll have total control. That's it. Thank you very much. Brilliant. Thank you. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Come on. I'm gonna make your mind tonight. Pulling your hair, baby. I feel you breathing on me, on you. You know that I'm a selfish lover. When it's mine, I've worn it. One track, mine for it. For you. I don't think I can. Now then, easy, easy. It, it's a family channel. <laughs> Paige's coming back now. Why, why the ice cream no. off quick? Wipe it off. <laughs> she, Paige's gone to Granddad's the loo. Really Granddad's got to give, give the grandson a bit of ice cream, haven't they? I didn't do anything. I've done nothing, Paige. I've done nothing. <laughs> he likes it, Is that mommy. nice? Is that yummy? Right, we're going to end it here in Market uh, Place, the Market Place <laughs> in Mansfield. I've got ice cream all down me. You have? Yeah, you have got ice cream. I can't believe you was filming me while I was eat, trying to eat it. Now then, steady on, it's a family channel. Anyway, uh, we've got Paige there. Thank you for joining us in this today's uh, video, today's vlog. We managed to find a Mr Whippy. I have to say though, not the best, a bit too creamy for me. Yes, it was a little bit. Yeah, not okay. the best. Not the most expensive though either. No, it was a good um, price because we had the medium Do you know what though, you made me break in. I'd got a fiver. <laughs> you made me break me like ten of them, didn't you? Oh yeah, I'll drink uh, anyway, drink yeah. your water. I've got water in my back. You could have had some of that. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, click the thumbs up, do all that stuff, yeah. uh, and we'll see you guys in, in the, the next, next one. one. Can you? St all she's done is win. It's too hot. Come on, it's too hot. Or if it's too I'm hot. I'm not winged. You're, I, you're like Vic, you're like a female version of Vic of me. I have not. <laughs> That's, that is the problem. Spending too much time with you. Anyway, on that bombshell, we'll see you guys in the next one. Come on. I'm leaving that in Mansfield Marketplace, it'll be gone.